Okay, so the next thing we're going to do is make our bowl. And this is bowl, and bowl is a natural clay, but you can see that it comes in a range of colours. And the, the most common ones, the most used ones, are these two here, the red and the yellow. And for perfect gilding, we always give it at least one coat of yellow first. And if you're doing gilding of ornate things and so forth, that's so that, partly, so that um, if you miss any areas, the yellow will help to disguise, it'll simulate the gold in any areas you've missed. But also, yellow bowl has particular characteristics, which it, it flows very well and helps just to give an extra, extra, extra perfect base before putting on the other, um, the other bowls. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take one level tablespoonful of that yellow bowl out of there and put it in my pan. I haven't actually got any heat on, but I have had a little bit. The pan is just warm. And again, we don't want to get this hot. Um, just keep it warm, sort of a little above blood temperature, and certainly no hotter than you'd have a bath. And with that, I'm now going to put three parts of my rabbit skin glue size to so there's three parts of the rabbit skin the original rabbit skin glue remember I said right at the beginning put some clean rabbit skin glue aside clean size aside and that's what it was for and then I'm just going to put one part of water in here um, so that was one part of the bowl, one part of water, and three parts of the original rabbit skin glue size. And now, using a nice stiff string bound fitch, I need to really mix that up. And can take a little while to mix this up. And okay, just stop that. 